Congratulations, you watched all four parts of The Rise of Scar. You truly are a Lion King fan? I promise you the last part is the best part. Let's watch and react to The Lion King, The Rise of Scar. Once upon a time, there was the scarred king of Pride Rock. King Scar, the meerkats of the North request an audience. Get on with it. Your Majesty, we meerkats have always been safe in the Pride Lands, but the hyenas, they attack us without consequence. Excessive hunting has caused everyone to migrate, leaving the meerkats as food. Well, what do they want me to do about it? What would Mufasa do? He's not here, I am. That is enough, Scar. Your subjects are suffering. King. I can't solve every pathetic creature's problem. You created the problem when you let the hyenas in. Mufasa kept us safe and you... I'll take your tongue for those words. It burns. What did you do to my eyes? What have you done, Rafiki? I haven't done anything. This is your dream. I heard your incantations. I know a spell when I hear one. Of course you do. You were taught by the best me, but I assure you, this is only a dream and I'm only part of your mind. Then what does this all mean? It means change your path or this is your future. Scar. Not so loud. I'm asleep. Not dead, Shenzi. Well, I'll be dead if Mufasa catches me out here. What's the plan? I told you, my plan is Zazu. No offense, but nobody likes you. Why would that bird help? Never mind that. We just need Bansai and Ed to do their job. The bird will take care of the rest, whether he knows it or not. How's it look in the south? All clear. That's strange. We don't have any hunting parties in that area. Zazu, sir, reports are coming in that the Okapi are restless. Should I investigate? No, no, I'll take a look. You all continue your patrols. <clears throat> they are acting strange. Maybe Queen Saraby and her sisters are on the hunt. There doesn't appear to be any poachers about. The danger has passed, I suppose. Wrong! The danger's right here! Yeah! You two are trespassing. I demand that you leave at once. We can't leave. We came all this way for you. Oh my, why me? Let's just say you got friends in high places. Yeah, yeah, yeah! You mouth breathers won't be laughing once I find Mufasa. Hey, go easy, Ed. Scar wants him alive. <laughs> no chomping, Ed. Wait, Ed! Yes, please wait. I'm a very important civil servant. You almost ruined everything. Oh! Don't fret, my old pal. Once Scar is king, we'll be in Chomp Chomp Paradise. But we gotta take a few lumps for the team. Ah! I've never seen them this deep into the Pride Lands. Zazu, we've been looking for you. Now the wildebeest are acting strange. There's no time for that. Sound all the alarms. I must find Mufasa. Sire, hyenas in the Pride Lands. Now, this time... Sire! Hyenas in the Pride Lands! Zazu? Take Simba home. Oh, Dad, can I come? No, son. <laughs> I never get to go anywhere. Oh, young master, one day you will be king. Then you can chase those slobbering, mangy, stupid poachers from dawn until... Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. With the king distracted, you and Shenzi herded all this food here. I told you I would deliver. Yeah, you ain't that bad, Scar. Oh, darling, I'm worse. Hey! Shenzi and I have been talking. I think it's time you step down from the throne. That was surprisingly easy. Are you sure your people will follow me? There may be a few stragglers, but without Zuor, they won't be a problem. What are we looking at? You two are alive. I was sure Mufasa would have killed you. This day is full of surprises. One more surprise, Scar. These stragglers and I are going to eat you and those traitors alive. Stop embarrassing yourself, Queen, and stand down. Surrender? Half of the hyenas are still with me. This is war. But you're forgetting the vultures. You must be joking. You mean those two tiny, timid twits that abandoned you. You can add thespians to that list. Their mission was to return when needed, to return as more than two. Come on, attack! <coughs> no, get away from me. Go, join the wake, my friends. Take that, Zua. Yeah, and don't ever come back. So did we do good, Scar? You displayed competence, bravo. When Pride Rock is mine, you may eat your fill with impunity. Yes! Now be gone, buzzards, before I change my mind. Now what, boss? Now, my friends, all the pieces are in place. The Cub Prince's days are numbered. I swear by the stars, Pride Rock will be mine. What a great ending. Scar now has his army. He has a chance to defeat Mufasa and his lion guards. It's funny Scar was right. He cannot match Mufasa's brute strength, but he is smart and knows how to plan an attack. Imagine if he wasn't so greedy for the throne. 
Scar and Mufasa would have had a great kingdom if they both ruled together as two brothers. I am happy to see the vultures come back. It was nice seeing them get rewarded for their loyalty to Scar. Can you imagine it almost mess up the whole plan? That is the only thing that could have gone wrong if at ate Zazu, then none of this would happen. That is a crazy theory, don't you think? If Zazu died, everything would have changed. I can't wait to hear the theories about how Zazu... I kind of feel like if it wasn't for him, Mufasa would still be alive. Wouldn't that be a crazy theory? Well, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this series as much as I did. Leave a like if you want more Lion King comics and I will do my best to dub them for you.